Hi guys and welcome back to another episode on Zetacraft. In today's episode, we're gonna be actually working back on uh, the Mega Base, which yeah, this might be a bit you know surprising because last episode we start well not well eh, not fully last episode, but we started working on our mini game over here, and um yeah, there's still st there's still stuff to do. But uh, what I said yesterday, well not yesterday, sorry, it was the last episode was about you know actually how how to make this game and stuff like that yada yada whatever and um i opted with actually having a pretty smart idea basically i'm gonna record you know me making it but i will show you the you know all the replays and stuff like that right after the mini games actually finished so you're going to be able to see the you know the hot the all of the progress in the mini game but the progress will be you know delayed until the mini game is actually going to be released so then every zeta will be able to experience the game before the video will be made so i think i'm just going to do that and uh work on it uh, pretty much throughout the episodes and just i uh, hope for the best but anyway back on track as i said before in this episode i want to start working back again on the mega base and actually not only on the mega base but the actual mega base castle but there are actual multiple problems with the castle and well one of them would be it's actually not finished in the creative t in the creative testing world so first i have to finish that then uh, we need to get all the resources to you know to actually make the castle and then uh get a specific mod which i completely forgot about the name of the mod which uh, i forgot the name of it b-dubs used it in his new let's play i forgot the building of b-dubs let's play i forgot the mod name but anyway uh, the main block type which we're going to be using in the castle will be uh all the sand variants well, not all the sand variants but you know we're going to be using sand uh, sandstone and smooth sandstone which will require a lot of sand but there's also another block that i'm gonna be using a lot and that would be birch which is actually quite a unusual block for me because i don't actually work with uh, birch blocks that often when we'll go out to uh, you know get all the sand and sandstone i could finally restock a minimalistic sand because uh that thing hasn't been restocked in ages. And oh yeah, as you can see, uh, there's going to be a lot of copper in this uh, castle. So that's not going to be fun. And oh my god, I forgot. And also cobble deep slate. Well, not cobble deep slate, but a variant of deep slate. And that's going to be a bit of a pain to get because, you know, nobody likes mining deep slate. And if you do like mining deep slate, then um, can you mine for me? That would be very appreciated. Oh yeah, and in between episodes, uh, there was actually an auction going on. Uh, right over here, this was Geek Squeak's auction house. It's not really a house, but whatever. Uh, anyway, these are the three shulker boxes which were over here, and uh, I paid 11 diamonds, which I think I got a good deal here. Why? Well, especially in this blue um, amazing shulker box, there was a beacon. And beacons are, I'm pretty sure, like 16 diamonds each. Used to be 32 diamonds, now 16. But anyway, I wanted to get a beacon for a cheaper price because uh, beacons are a bit expensive and also you know there's a lot of grass and there's just some other nice stuff in here. What did I take out of this one? Oh yeah I do remember I took out the two gravels and put them right here for the pavement. Plus I got some potions which might come in handy later on and um, yeah I honestly think I got a good deal plus these three shocker boxes. And well let's see how much does a shocker box sell for nowadays? Um. Shocker box here, that doesn't say. Uh, two diamonds each, so I saved about nine diamonds, I think. But anyway, I think this is a perfect time to hop into a time lapse of me grinding all the materials for the castle. Let's go! Hello guys, we're back, and um, as you can see, this area behind me, does this area look familiar? 
If you don't, then I'll remind you. This is the area which we just excavated, and all the sand is back in the places where it used to belong. Uh, not in these shulker boxes. No, back here. Why? Well, uh, I'm, I'm gonna explain. I'm pretty sure it's because the server crashed or had some maintenance issues, so uh, the server needs to be reset by a couple of hours, so all the grinding which I did in these time lapses all went to waste. And, and the reason why I'm not gonna go and do another, you know, all the time lapses again is because, well, I can't. I would. Actually, no, I wouldn't. I'll just do this in my own time. But the reason why I can't, even if I, you know, would to for another for whatever reason um i can't because the replay mod is in 1.18.1 while the server right now is in 1.18.2 this is because the server for some reason isn't really working in 1.18.1 so uh it's now in 1.18.1 not point two so yeah now i'm just gonna you know excavate all the sand and stuff like that and uh, what the heck did i do huh that nah. You saw that, right? You saw that, guys, right? What's that? Huh. You know what? I'm not going to question it. It's, that's probably why the server crashed in the first place. I'm not going to judge it. Anyway, how many stacks do I have? Ugh, okay, nearly a full shocker box. Oh, yeah, and uh, by the way, this is, we, we need to get, like, what? Three full shocker boxes worth of sand. Because, well, well, we only actually need one full shocker box of sand for the, um, for the Mega Base Castle. But then I also want to kind of, you know, restock, uh, was it, Minimalistic? Because I haven't restocked the sand in Minimalistic since, like, I don't know, since a very long time ago. So, um, yeah, I, I, I gotta do that. And, uh, I mean, I don't have to. I could do it another day, but then, will I do it another day? Anyway, another two more shulker boxes worth of sh sand. Uh, I'll say, I, I don't like doing this. I really don't. Why did I think it's a good idea to sell sand? I mean, it's a grinding material. That's probably the reason why it sells. Okay, how many stacks do we have? Okay, this is almost another sh shocker box full of sand. Ah, uh, come on. I believe in me. I believe in myself. I can do this again. Wait. No. No, 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 no. This does mean... Ah, no. Ah. Oh. Wait, no, this is... <laughs> well, if I'm not horrendously wrong... Does this mean that all the cob the the copper which I waited at um was it at Ricky's super smelter you know as mega base it, it's it's all back to raw copper ah oh, I waited like a whole hour for all of it to smelt now I've got to wait a whole hour again unless I'm wrong and it's already smelted in you know it's already smelted and it's in one of my chests. You know what? I decided to not just to get the two sh shulker boxes worth of sand. Why? I don't have the third shulker box on me. That's, uh... Yeah, I kind of forgot to do that while recording. So, uh, I, you know, I paused the recording, then I got the shulker box, and then I flew back. But the shulker box was, like, half filled with items. So, uh, yeah, my shulker box was a bit overfilled and stuff like that. It wasn't fun. So I'm just gonna get, like, two stacks and just... Fill up my inventory, hopefully, and uh, just see where that le leads us. Okay, come on, just this last uh, bunch of sand, and then we got this. Come on, I want just a bit more sand, and we're, we're, we're done. Come on, uh, let's see. We got we have how much do we have? Okay, these chocolate boxes are both full. Let's throw this out, let's get this. This is about what is uh, six, twelve to fourteen. Uh, 16, uh, 18 stacks, sure, 18 stacks and 2 chocolate boxes worth of sand, that's good enough. Ah, it's pra it's practically full, it, it, that's pretty much full, you know, it, it's practically full, I don't need to restock for another 5 months. Oh no, here it is, it didn't, no, ah, I need to, oh, I need to smelt down all of these blocks of copper. Oh, that's gonna that's going to take so long. You know what? I, I no, I'm just gonna leave this here for now. I'm gonna do it later. Still, we can't even start the castle until replay mode comes out for 1.18.2. And here I am. And what happened to this? What the heck? That's that's so bizarre. Let, let's just check again. That's so bizarre. I can't believe I'm doing this twice. And we're here. That's that's great. I'm so happy that I'm back here again, just mining for the same material. 
<laughs> anyway, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna get through this. It wasn't fun the first time, it's not gonna be fun the second time. I mean, last time I was listening to, you know, a podcast, but this time I'm just gonna... Be here. Mining and placing. Mining and placing. Mining and placing. Finally, the first layer of placing the TNT is done. Now, it's time to explode it. One, a two, a three, a four, and we'll be fine. Oh, diamonds right here. Okay, let's see. I've got, I've got four and I'm going to have silk touch for now. I'm just going to silk touch it. <sighs> okay, well, this is going to take a while. Okay, done the first layer. Now, like another five more to go. Ah, uh, it's not, it's not fun. Honestly, I just don't understand how people enjoy mining for deep state. Like, if you enjoy mining for deep state without using TNT, who are you? I want to know who you are. Even if you, even when you're using a beacon, it's super slow. I, just, I don't understand how it's enjoyable. Diamonds, finally. Oh, I'm so, finally got some diamonds. No, I just fortune them. Ah, I just didn't mean to fortune them. Ah. Okay, this will be the last one. Did we get any diamonds? That's the real question, isn't it? Well, let's look. And we have none, obviously. <laughs> Not surprised. Hey, that's pretty good. So we we got a total of 29 diamonds. Uh, over a full shocker box of, uh, what was it? Of Cobble Deep State, which actually I didn't have last time when I did that, uh, done this. Because I ran off TNT and I wasn't bothered to mine uh, more Deep State by hand. So, we actually got, um, well, more diamonds and more deep slate. We got the shocker box full of cobble deep slate, and, uh, we can't really do anything else from just waiting until replay mod comes out. So, um, yeah, I need to think of something. Um, um, hmm, hmm, um, 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 I got an idea. Let's prank some Zetas. Why not? It's gonna be funny. Well, it depends how funny it could be. It might be blowing up something. Perhaps, maybe. Or could be as much just, you know, renaming items. And the pranks? Well, some of them will definitely include this block right here. So let's get to work. Okay. Come on, please. Let's just have a, sing a single door. Okay, here. Come on. Double. No. No, no pressure plates. No. Please. Someone have pressure plates, please. Somewhere. Wait, what? Okay, it exploded, but I don't know for what reason. Here it is. Here's the mushroom. This is how it's gonna look like. And let's just quickly test out if it if, if this works. So we do this. The TNT ignites. And please don't blow up. It didn't. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, let me yeah, we just put this back again on here. Then we just put the TNT again. The nether rack and the, the warped anilium. And then we fly out. And that's the prank the prank done. Okay, well he is in the line, but let's go and prank Maya. Oh my god, this area looks so nice. Oh my god, I I definitely need to start working on my area and my area again. I mean I was supposed to, but then replay mod. Oh well. Anyway, he's an online, so I can take a little bit more time searching this area. And now I just need to be look, looking out for stuff like trapdoors. Not trapdoors, I always get mixed, I always mix them up. I mean, um, pressure plates. So we put the, nope, the other way around. That's not good. Okay. The observer this way. The TNT will be there. And the water will be right here. TNT here. Uh, dirt here, pods all here, and then the- Oh, no way, that's not a good idea. Wait, first we need to- Wait, which way was the door? I don't remember. Um, it's just- Was it like this? I don't know. Oh, God. He might realize that something happened. I don't remember where his- How- how Which direction his door was facing. Okay, this should work. I'm not gonna test it. I'm just gonna go out and- uh, and if any of these break, uh, well not break, but if any of these pranks go, you know, um, wrongly in some way, then um, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna pay them in diamonds, probably like, what, three, three diamonds. Let's see, oh wow, oh, I, no, I have, whoa, 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 this is, 
Oh wow, oh. Ah. Ah. Oh no! Um. Well, this isn't good, is it? I'm not entirely sure what to do in this scenario. You know, I really do want to. Oh god, this red storm right there, but. Oh, I really do want a prank cable. Oh, I, oh, okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. What could it possibly... Okay, where could I possibly do it that he wouldn't realise that I did it? Oh, I see, I see. Okay, I see his name tag, I see his name tag. Okay, if he's over there... Hey, how high am I? Okay. I think this will be fine. He might hear me. <laughs> oh no, this is so stressful. I just need to make a pile of TNT and that's it. Okay, he's doing whatever, he, whatever he's doing. And I think, okay, I think it's a good enough pile. Okay, I think it's it's a good enough pile. So um, I'll just, oh, where where where, where would I put the lever? I'll put the lever here, and and I will. I actually no. Before I do anything with the lever, I just have to do it now. That's not the. Oh no, that was very loud. I meant to do this. No, not that either. Uh, there, this. No, <sighs> I don't. I can't uncrouch. Uncrouch. Okay. And done. Okay. Now, now it will be fine. Now it will be fine. Now I'm gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Okay, I dare you. Uh. D -d 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 Do it. Okay, you know, honestly, I think that's gonna be enough. I'm just gonna stop placing this redstone around over here. Okay. This is fine. Okay, this is fine. Now I just need to get my oak fence, my, my, my oak signs, sorry, and then leave. Leave. And fireworks. Get out! Okay, the trap's over there, and cable's somewhere underneath there, and hopefully it's all gonna work out well. And now, we are going to prank time. We need to fill up, figure out, but actually, you know, we need to figure out where to build my next prank. Uh, I want it to be on the island, because I already actually pranked him once, um, already this season at the very beginning. Anyway, now we make this prank. Oh god. Honestly, I have no clue what I'm doing. I'm uh, supposed to be a monster. Uh, let's see how it's gonna turn out. Oh god, let's see how he how it looks like. Oh god, it's beautiful. I love it. <laughs> I actually didn't mean... That actually looks quite nice. <laughs> Obviously, now we need to give it some eyebrows. What am I doing? This is... <laughs> Oh, I wasn't supposed to be making this today. This was even bad. <laughs> oh, God, no. Oh, I love it. You know, normally when I when I plan on making a Xenocraft episode, I don't plan on making a, a weird, beautiful looking ice monsters <laughs> in other people's bases. I think of more about, you know, my mega base and uh, the mini game. But not this. But sometimes, it's definitely worth it. Especially, I actually usually don't build in a... Um, oh, I forgot the what style of building this is. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Hello. Ah, well he caught me, that's not good. His name's Bob and he loves eating packed ice. Ah, Bob. I love you so much. This is the pinnacle of my building abilities. <laughs> I love, oh god, I love him so much. Uh, oh, Bob, I I seriously love you. You're you're my favorite crea creation I've ever made in Minecraft, by far. And you're pretty much finished. But let's first see if we should add any teeth to to him. Let's see. Um, uh, I don't know. Ooh. Well, this is a fifty-fifty. Uh, the, te the teeth are pretty nice, but then uh, I don't know. Let let's check. Let's check okay, because at this moment he looks more of a blob. Uh, like right, like right now he looks more of a blob. That's what that's called. That's called the reason I named him Bob. Well, what do I what what do I even say to this? But obviously I built on times uh, uh, you know land, so he's gonna do whatever he wants to do with Bob. And um, yeah um, uh, good goodbye Bob to uh. A later day passed to a person that I don't actually see that often on the server because we live in two completely different time zones. It would be Hypnojo. Okay, here's the tongue so far, and I don't, I don't, I don't think that's too bad. Okay, hey, that's that's really not too bad. But first, I actually, want to get the main stru uh, structure of the Bob. 
and then actually work on the on the inside of his uh, mouth going down like this and uh okay maybe a little bit more curviness and uh, stuff like this okay that's too far but yeah stuff like that oh god no uh, he looks absolutely hideous i love him and i absolutely love him actually ah uh, it's too far i think i should probably not have it as far and obviously because it's a gift they can obviously remove it and do whatever they want to to this creature which i'm making it's only here as as a joke or they can keep him honestly i i'm gonna probably make my own one and and i'll keep him and name him and feed him maybe if i won't forget ah uh, there he is oh, i love him even more oh, I, I i i love all of them oh, i really do and let's see and yeah no okay i think it's better yeah no for this one yeah it's better to have them uh as slabs instead of full blocks and oh my god i absolutely love it it's it's an absolute screenshot right here oh just just like that you sir will be eating granite his name's fred and he loves eating granite well goodbye fred and uh hopefully hypnodrome will be feeding you granite soon okay let's see so his tongue will come out this way like that and um probably his body's gonna sink afterwards and yeah that, that's pretty much the outline of his body and here's most likely going to be the shape of his front side and as always let's just you know give him some eyebrows oh yeah no he he looks absolutely adorable now <laughs> why why what is this passion i found i why, why? I, I need to know my I need to ask myself after this recording what, what what's wrong with me <laughs> like I mean it's beautiful I'm not gonna say it isn't but just why well then he's not fully finished but I do want him to have a name his name's Rick and he loves eating and it's like okay let's see him now um nah you know what I'm definitely gonna be experimenting with the claw because I'm not entirely happy about the claw so well i'm gonna be experimenting with that one maybe i'll expand him and maybe do something with the stalagmite no the the, the i don't remember the stalagmites and the other i don't remember these that way the stalagmites and stalactites i'm pretty sure these are stalagmites but anyway guys this will be the end of episode 12 of zetacraft so if you enjoyed me building rick fred and bob then I'm glad to hear and goodbye. <laughs>